Welcome once again. How you doing? Hope you are doing fast, fantastic. Good. Now today we are going to convert PDF over one thousand four hundred and seventy-five pages into editable Excel. It doesn't matter how volume it is. It might be five thousand pages, four thousand. Don't be scared of the number of PDF. Use this my format, and you can convert any volume of pdf given to you to exit now this tax was given to me i'm proud of what i do i work with an audit firm and this bank statement was given to my team and i picked it upon myself that we are not going to do this manually imagine we are doing this manually how many months will it take and this is something we need to deliver very urgently i pick it up on myself and i made a research and i am my research was productive i came out with editable excel which i shared with my team and they were very happy so i deem it fit to bring it out here because i know it's going to benefit those that work with an audit firm yes i'm yeah, I'm proud to, to be an auditor, yes. Task consultant, whatever you can uh, get in touch with me, I will discuss that. Now let's go back to business. Today we are going to use some tools like MX Excel, MX Word, and we are going to use I Love My PDF. We are going to use I Love My PDF okay okay good let me let you now look and see if i have it here so we're going to use a lot of my pdf to do this now don't say i know i love my pdf please follow me and watch this i love my pdf is just a tool i want to use to achieve this ms word is also a tool i want to use to achieve this excel is also a tool we want to use to achieve this this life is partner for you to succeed you have to partner so let's start with i love my pdf let's go let's type i love my pdf is here good then come here convert pdf to excel it's fantastic convert pdf to excel but that is not what we are going to do we are not converting PDF to because you cannot put PDF of 101,000 something and above on I love my PDF and it will convert. No, 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 it will not. Even if it converts, it's going to convert it into sheets, multiple sheets for you, which bringing it together will be something disastrous. So just follow this process. What we are going to do, we are not going to convert, but we are going to what? Split. We are going to split our PDF file. Now, let's choose our PDF file. Yes, I have it in my desktop, which is here. Here is our PDF file. We pick it. Yes, we have it now. Now, this is the number of pages. This is the page one. Here we have 1,475 pages of this PDF. It's here. But what, what we are going to do now, we're going to split it into 2,200. I would advise you go with 2,200 pages. If you go with 400, it will, it's fine. It can go. But like 500, 600, you will have issues doing this. So it's better you come down low. So I would strongly advise 200 to 400. But for the purpose of this, le this lesson, this video, I'm going to use 200. So if we use 200 for each conversion, 200 each conversion, you will end up having about like how many sheets? Like five to six sheets, right? Good and fine. So let's come here from one to 200 is our first target. 
one to two hundred yes so we're going to put 200 here so automatically we are going to pick from first page one to 200 that is one thing i discovered this my page one this page one i don't really need it so i want to start it from page two now well what I'll get now is from figures from page two to 200. So you know what you want in your bank statement. Then you map it out so that you get what you really want. You can do it month by month from 1st to 30th January, from 1st to this January, February, 28th February. So you map it out the way you want. Now, they might give you a bank statement in which you just needed some few more in between. You map it. Say you are unique from this range to this range. So this is the range I've chosen for the purpose of this video. So now let's split. We split in. Down splitting. Let's download it. Downloaded. Right? This is 2 to 200 let's do one again it's opening which i'm going to close it this is the one we just split it so let me do one again let's do one again you go to split please make sure you go to split pdf then you select you go back to that same pdf you pick it you open it now it will still bring you from one to one four seven five now we need from 200 201 to 400 right yes sorry so 400 sorry I put 4,000. Now, 201 to 400, right? That is our range. Remember, you can use your own range. This is for the purpose of this video. You then we split. Yes, we download. Now, if you use uh, this to convert, if you use this to convert now, let's use it as, but this is not what i want to do if you use this to convert to pdf it's going to split it into sheets for you in fact i don't want to go there into sheets but this one i'm going to do is going to do all this in one sheet each split in one sheet so let's go to our download see the ones we downloaded from 2 to 200 and from 200 201 to 400 now the next two we are going to use is our ms word we go to ms word we go to file we go to open then we go to browse it's loading then once you come to browse, then you locate the splitted PDF, which is this two. I'm picking this one first, then you open. It's loading. It's loading. It's loading. Then you just say, okay. Let's watch it. It's loading. If you see here, it's reading. Just be patient until it finishes reading. You know, when you discover something that will help people, you'll be glad. You understand? You'll be glad. Touch your life. You see, when, oh, you're still loading. You're still loading. You're still loading. This process, you have to trust it. You have to trust it. I think this will be very useful to those in audit firm. Big four, they need it, yes. The big fours need it. Now, we have it here. 
but what we have here is in what ms word so the next step is for us to take this to what mx excel which we are going to do right away we're going to do control a and highlight everything and highlight everything everything is highlighted now we'll go to our excel please don't use you may use right click but what i'm using here is control v to paste straight control v to paste you might want to use your right click or uh, your mouse and at times it might not respond but if you do that and you didn't respond please use control v it did not respond so let's go back and see what happens to our ms word is still yeah, the system is still loading because the load is much let's copy again let's come here yeah i didn't allow it to settle down so control v the system is is making some noise which i need to allow it to settle down so if you notice that in your system also just allow it to settle down before you paste control v now this is the control v it's loading it's loading yeah i made a research on this and it's really helped my team and we converted our our pdf to a editable excel in which we used to prepare our financial statements this was from 2018 to 2020, 2020 2023 you could imagine voluminous that pdf could be now we have it here it's coming up it's coming up now once you have this here you need a little idea of a data analytic <laughs> see accounting will expose you to so many things accounting will expose you to so 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 many things and that is what accounting will do for you now we have it here the next thing we're going to do is to take out the things we need and the things we do not need now first thing i'm going to hi highlight all here copy it come to the next page here and i'm going to paste just the value no format the first one was pasted with format but this one just the value and it will come up to something like this for me you see this is an editable excel now but don't be too nice these are the dates but because i pasted it as value that is why this date is coming like this don't be scared what you do you highlight these two then you come here then you go to short date short date you see the date here good and fine then the figure that we need is just your debit your credit and your balance then you make it to look like figure let it not look <laughs> make it look like figure okay so you have it like this mind you i don't need these two rows i'm going to delete it mind you i don't need here i'm also going to delete it here yeah, let me expand it a little so the aim is not to enter into uh, analyzing the bank statements for you here you know how to analyze your bank statement the aim is to show you how to convert this pdf bank statement into editable excel now you have your excel you can do your sorting you can do your your filtering sorting you can do whatever you can play with the figures here and get whatever you want to get from it yes everything is in one sheet 
mind you, this one here is pasted from the MS Word with the, with the format. But here I copied it and pasted it here with what just the value, and that is why we have all this. You can see we can edit this. We can edit it. We can edit it, you see. So all our figure here can be edited and you can extract it. You can analyze your bank statement. You can do whatever you want to do with it. I hope this video helps someone. I hope this video has saved someone. It is stressful. <laughs> yeah, thank you very much. I really appreciate you for watching. Do the needful by encouraging us and subscribe to our YouTube channel. More video will be coming on this. Then, if you have any question about these two acts, please don't fail to ask on the comment section. We are here to give you the best we can give. Yeah, we are professionals. We are professionals. Yeah, we are professionals. And my shout out to everyone in the accounting profession. Shout out to you. Those in audit firms, shout out to you. Those in corporate, those in M SME, those in NGOs, I say a big shout out to you all. Enjoy your day and you have a wonderful day ahead. Thank you very much. I remain humble, God is well. See you.